Hey stampers, again again, I keep forgetting where the camera is. <laughs> so I've had my order today from Stampin' Up, so I thought I'd come on and show you what I've got. So let's get started. I have bought the beautiful doilies, heart doilies from the, what's it called, that sweet, oh I've forgotten already, <laughs> what am I like? Um, oh. From my heart sweet. Yeah, I had everything except the red ribbon. I don't know why I didn't order the red ribbon. One it's three eighths of an inch red ribbon double stitch satin ribbon. That's the only thing I didn't buy from that suite. But I've got the doilies and I've got the gorgeous little um oh let me get the faceted gems. They're so pretty. That's they're so cute. Absolutely adorable. Oh, have I dropped one? Yeah, there it is. They're tiny, but they're so cute as well. I think you deer them down on the flat side, and they've got like a little uh, gem on the top. Unusual. Cute though. And they're in real red, flirty flamingo, and white. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Does it say how many you get? Uh, oh, wow. 180. I think I'll leave these glasses on for a little bit, but I can't look up, because every time I do, I can't say, oh, everything goes blurry. <laughs> so you get 40 of the doilies. That's not bad actually. Uh, flirty Flamingo Real Red, same as those. I got these Peaceful Poppy Sequins, absolutely stunning. And these are in black, gold, silver, red, and white on clear, sorry. But aren't they cute? Absolutely gorgeous, perfect for some shaker cards absolutely gorgeous and we're not just for that sweet really these would go they're so static they these <laughs> they stuck to me hands <laughs> yeah don't try picking them up and you can't get them back in look they were you have to flick oh my goodness they're stuck to my nails and everything <laughs> they don't want to they're like a little cling on it doesn't want to come off Well, Gainey, you shouldn't have done that. Right. Finally, there's another one there. Oh my gosh, don't put your fingers in them, you'll be covered. They're so statically charged, it's unreal. And I got the Daffodil Delight. I think Daffodil Delight. Ruched Ribbon. Absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, Daffodil Delight. Love it. And it's the it's a quarter inch, and then you've got this beautiful what colour is that? Petal pink, metallic edge stitched ribbon, uh, metallic edge ribbon. Yeah, so that is cute. I also bought the memories and more pack for the tropical. I do love the memories and more. Uh, the last one I wasn't too overly impressed with, but this one is great. So, isn't that cute? So you, you get doubles, and these are on the reverse, so that's that one. So, these are the reverses. See you soon. Reminds me of um, Hawaii. I've never been, but I bet it's gorgeous. I'm not fussed on the pineapple, but <laughs> everything else is beautiful. Love this one. This You got this in the big set as well, in the bigger card. So, that's that opposite. That's the opposite to that one. Cool, blimey. That's the opposite to that one. 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 
love the flower. That is beautiful, and I love this. I can't wait to get that sweet. Um, I started at the front of the book and made my way backwards, but I went to the back of the book as well, if you know what I mean, to get <coughs> the list on the back for all the little accessories. So that's the opposite for there. I had three of those, so I got an extra one, isn't that nice? <laughs> So that's the back of that. That's the back of that one. Mahala. That's the back of that one. The best is yet to come. Living today. So that's the back of that one. Hugs, kisses, and the good vibe wishes. And that's the back of that one. And then that's just a protector. And then you get two lots of two lots of two lots of stickers sunshine and tropical greetings thinking of you today and always thanks for these lovely i love them flowers love these borders so you get two of those and you get two of these as well enjoy more of those beautiful flowers and hearts these lovely labels i'll be doing something with those so that's that Love those. 50 odd designs, I think. You get 20, uh, 50 cards, 25 designs, two of each. And then these are the embossing folders I got. I got the stone one. That comes with the power of hope in the celebration. This is one, is the coastal weave. And this one, look at this one. Parisian beauty. I just got a little mark inside mine. Oh, it's only fluff. It was fluff, it's okay. A little bit of fluff. Beautiful design, look at that. Absolutely stunning. Gorgeous. Now I think let's oh to show you the DSPs now. Oh you've probably seen them all in your book anyway, but I like to show what I've had. Put them to one side. So I got the birthday bonanza. What it's called. I'll have a look on the back in a minute. So I've reversed them. I've done flipped one, flipped one, so you can see the birthday bonanza. Yeah, it's basic black Bermuda Bay, coastal cabana, crumb cake, daffodil delight, grapefruit grove, mango melody, terracotta tile, smoky slate, and whisper white. I think it's really cute. So this one is this on the back, and then how cute and adorable but these you don't have to just use for that sweet because these would go with any birthday set i think they're just fabulous obviously if you're using this side um, but i think the opposite side is absolutely de delightful and would go with anything i love it and that's uh the opposite side that that's this the reverse of that one. Oh, hey there what's happening Oh yeah, 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 that's right. Oh, I picked an extra one up. So they're these gorgeous, cute little lines. I might buy the stamp set, actually. I'm not going to go for the dies, but I'll definitely buy the stamp set. Then that's the reverse. And then candles, again, absolutely adorable. That's the reverse. Go with any birthday sweet. How cute is this koala? You could actually fussy cut that out and then just use any happy birthday stamp set. You know, just do a bit of fussy cutting and stick them on a card. But look at the reverse. I love that. This shape pops up quite a lot with stamping up. Love it. And then you've got the toucans. How adorable. Again, fussy cut them out. Stick them on a card. And then that's the opposite. Absolutely gorgeous. So cute. But like I'm saying, you don't have to just use them with the birthday bonanza suite you could use them on any you could use them with the meerkats out of the celebration your free item that'd be cute so there's one lot and these next two were out of celebration these were free absolutely beautiful and these are bermuda bay blackberry bliss coastal cabana float flamingo garden green gorgeous grape granny apple green 
Grateful Grove, Highland Heather, Lovely Lipstick, Mellow Mambo, Pool Party and Pretty Peacock. So, and if you don't, if you're not into busy patterns, because I'm not normally a busy pattern person, but I do like the reverse. Look at that. That'd go great with, um, it starts with art, because you've got a painting in there. And then these, absolutely beautiful. Quite a busy one, but it's pretty. Very pretty. I love the back. I love that. Beautiful. Go with any colour, uh, any sweet. Especially on the reverse. That's a bit dark for me, but I do love the reverse. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. And then this one all looks hand painted. Absolutely gorgeous. Looks like it's been painted on canvas. And there's the reverse. Any sweet again, this would go with. And then this one. This is quite pretty, but I love the reverse of this one. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. The next one is even nicer. So, and again, another busy pattern, but I love the underneath. Oh, look at that. Do you have that against um, the lovely lipstick foils? Oh, that would be beautiful with some gorgeous sentiments on there. Absolutely love it. Oh, thank you, Mr. Boy. My parcel's just finally arrived. I've been waiting all day for it. <laughs> See you later, babe. Uh, so that's that one, and it's called Lily Impressions. Then these, oh my goodness, are my favourites up to now, out of all of them. And the, this and the, um, the Parisian one, that's very pretty. But I love black and white. Oh, I love them. This is, this is a freebie. So this is what you get on the reverse. Absolutely gorgeous. So one side's foiled and the other one isn't. I love black and white. Can't go wrong. So you've got this one as well with the little beehives and on the reverse is the gold honeycomb great for mail cards i think especially this one and the next one and it's reverse perfect for a gentleman card you can just see the back of that oh definitely absolutely gorgeous and then <clears throat> you've got this pattern again good great for gentlemen's cards and unless you want to just use this side which is so cute isn't that lovely beautiful foiling another gorgeous one this is the reverse of this again mail cards they scream at me then you see, i see black and gold together just does and i like this one you can color the background and then color the flowers whatever color you want and just make this paper come to life and then you've got the dots, uh, the dashes on the back, which are beautiful. Again, another thing reminds me of uh, stuff I would use on mail cards. But I love black and white stripes. I adore it. Absolutely adore it. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. And that's a freebie. Cannot go wrong for a freebie. Love it. Love black and white. Love it. Whoa, I'm only re I'm only leaving my glasses on just until I can finish reading these off the back. So this is just flirty flamingo, real red and whisper white. And obviously that one was black, white and gold. From my heart, uh special design of this paper. Again, half of these are foiled, I think. So this is the reverse uh this one's not got foil on. Some of them have, some of them haven't. So this isn't got no foil on, but I love the stripes. Bright as hell. Uh, the little love heart. I love the arrows. I think they are absolutely adorable. They've got small ones and further on they've got the really large ones. Now that's got foil on. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. And I love pinstripe. That can go on anything. Just love it. And then that's the opposite. Um, and then I was a bit confused with this lot paper and the next lot. 
because uh, you'll see now you got the pink and red with the white background and it's switched around it's got it's red and white with a pink background the next one is and I was thinking oh my goodness they've sent me the same but I do like this gorgeous 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 oh is that the one from the yeah that one's got the pink background and this one's got the it's because I was thinking they sent me four of the same <laughs> and it's not it's that one and then that's the reverse that's got foil on love these arrows absolutely adorable and then that's the reverse cute I bet you could punch these out with the punches I know you can on certain ones cute 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 and then that's the reverse oh no this is this one now and that's the reverse sorry so they definitely come out, out with a punch. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. You get uh, 25 love hearts on there. And um, that's the reverse. Oh, I did have it the wrong. Oh, what am I doing right? Wrong. There we go. That's the right way. So I bought those as well. Loving it. This is my second attempt at filming because I'd done all this earlier and then went to press stop recording and I hadn't even pressed the record button. <laughs> it's difficult. So this is my second showing, but you will only see it one, thankfully. And then these, I bought these. I'm not really a great lover of this paper. Uh, it's but I love the reverse. If you'll get what I mean in a minute, because I think these could be a bit too busy. I mean, I will use it. Ugh. But I don't like its reverse. But, you know, you can't buy a whole packet of paper and not have one, maybe, or two you're not fussed on. It's okay ish. But I don't like the reverse. I don't know. It does nothing for me. But there is another one which is coming up next. And it's exactly the same, but different colours. Yeah, I like that one. See what I mean? That one is more autumn -y to me and wintry, and I like that one. But I wasn't fussed on that one. I don't think it looks right with that blue background for some reason. But that's my opinion. I bet most ladies would love these papers. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. But I like this. But I adore the reverse. Look at that. But that's my choice. I mean, I'm not going to force it on anybody, but the, I, I do love that. I think that is gorgeous. And again, not too fussy on this. It's okay-ish. I, I don't mind the reverse. I love that. It's strange and it's plain, but I, I quite like that with the fading and stuff. Uh, again, not overly fussed on this one too big them poppies are for my liking but I love the reverse <laughs> I love this I think it's gorgeous absolutely stunning again another really busy pattern uh, it's okay ish but I love the reverse look at that how gorgeous these can be used anywhere absolutely any card now I like this you know yeah in a weird sort of way don't ask me why I like the fact that you can cut that in half and then get your six card fronts out of that and still have space to add a sentiment but I also love the reverse. <laughs> this is the reason I bought this uh, DSP is mainly for the reverse. It wasn't for anything to do with the poppies. Even though I like the stamp set, the ones in the book that come with, you've got two stamp sets and two lots of dies. Now I like the poppy one, painted poppy, and their dies. But I've got this stamp set, which was kindly given to me by a gorgeous Leanne Fenton from Australia, who happened to have two, so she sent one to me. Beautiful. Uh, but I don't like the dies that go with it. Uh, they're like layering dies on top of leaves, and it just did not float my boat at all. So, but thank you, Leanne, for the gorgeous sen uh, sentiment one. So that's that. 
DSP. Mainly I've bought, like I say, I, I, I don't like the, the reverse. That's the only one I don't like. I, I love everything else on the reverse, I mean. <laughs> but that's why I got it. The colours as well. So, have I read the colours out? Pace it Black, Blackberry Bliss, Calypso Coral, Crushed Curry, Flirty Flamingo, Mossy Meadow, Old Olive, Pool Party, Poppy Parade, Rich Razzleberry and Whisper White. These people. Right, now I can take these glasses off. Oh, because I can't see when I look up. Hi, I can see you now. <laughs> so I got the Umbrella Punch and the Tulip Punch as well. Because I always go for the punches first because they always tend to be on back order the longest if they go out of stock like the, pe the daisy punch or oh, last year the little one and then what the year before that with the big daisy punch oh they were on back order forever so I always go for punches first and bundles with punches <clears throat> so this one these two are all from the same region and I've gotten the couple uh, yeah these five I got um, at the, these were all out of the celebration I love that um, I love water lilies I love this I think it's so cute but it comes with a little punch but I don't know whether to get that next or not I don't know but that goes with that stone embossing folder this and the is it my meadow oh my goodness how amazingly gorgeous would these two be together love this not only you only get that one image in those things but I mean for a freebie they're good sized sentiments as well but can you imagine stamping about six of those cakes and then fussy cutting all those flowers and then spreading them that would make for a gorgeous, gorgeous um, floating frame card as well. Plus, it's in in a, in a in a. Oh, I do an oval instead. How's that? You have the floating frame. But this is beautiful. Look at those gorgeous little flowers. Fussy cut them out, and then just spread them all over a card. Absolutely gorgeous, and how cute. The I reason I bought the birthday bonanza is because of these little guys. They are so adorable and they go lovely with them birthday papers. I just think they're great. It says, happy birthday to a stand-up friend. Well, you could either use the happy birthday out of here, which is massive. It's a good size one. Look at that. Brilliant. Or out of any other set you've got. Oops. And use it to or get a funky like happy birthday one to use this so it's just not so small and then do some cards look how cute that is how cute so I love them I love that cake by the way this is gorgeous so you've got the stamp one side and obviously they got the back of the, of the stamp which is the actual shape of the flower now so you can turn it over to have your blocked colour so you can do it to all of them as well You get eight stamps, but when you flip them over and use them to put fill your colours in, it's like having 16. So, not bad at all. And this, how cute. Little tiny flowers. These beautiful flourishes here. More little flowers. Dots, leaves, uh, the leaves to go on here and there would make a perfectly gorgeous wreath card. And there's another set that would make has got little bits in like this as well perfect for making little wreath cards so that 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 and that plus the embossing folder and the two lots of paper what i had for freebies so i know and it these are absolutely gorgeous i am dying to play with this but i've got something to finish first before i can start playing so there were my freebies um, these are all cling stamps. I got the papers which you saw last week. Um, well, let me have a quick nose. 
c'est plus tu, 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 tu. Uh, The embossing folder, the ribbon. Uh, Forever Bloom. Yeah. And the Parisian Beauty stamp set and the uh, designer series paper. I'm getting the dies next. On oh, my third order, I think. So I've got more. I'm going to go for all the stamp sets first and then going to pay for the. Uh, there it is. That's what one goes with that one. Isn't that absolutely gorgeous? But if you notice the flower and the bird and the leaf, <coughs> they're in that um, new wonder stamp set. Yeah, let me show you. I can have a look quick. I think it's this one, is it? Oh, no, 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 sorry. It's free as a bird. Let me find that. Free as a bird. The little flower is very, very similar to that one, look. It's just got no little turnovers. The bird there is very similar to the bud there. And the leaves here are very similar to those leaves there. So, yeah. But very pretty. Gorgeous. I love that flourish. So now I'm going to have some colouring fun. Oh, my back and my hips. But that is absolutely stunning. I like the sentiments in them as well. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. And this background stamp, how beautiful. You could just have that with a nice sentiment of ribbons, gems, or you could fussy cut it out, but just the flowers. Stamp that and then fussy cut the flowers as a one picture and then layer them up, maybe too, too, too high to give that depth. You've got these flowers here. Apps. I'm going to have some lots of fun colouring with that. Absolutely love it. Last a lifetime. I like the sentiments in this. And it also, I got this to go with the So Inviting. I think they work, they're going to work really well together. Make beautiful, beautiful invitations. And also, with the address book I made, this and these can be used, just, and these lines can be used, so you can carry on printing your pages to put in your little address book that I made. Or you could just do the four lines and don't ink up them. So, mind you, they're all space. I would use those two lines and just stamp them twice for your address book. I love that. So well, that's what I bought that to go with. Sending all my love. You are invited. Oh, save the day. Perfect. Perfect. Well, I'm showing now the the cling ones first, so, and then I'll move on to the photo polymer. I love this. So sentimental. I can't thank you enough. I love things like that. Your friendship is a blessing wishing you much happiness today and always sending healing hugs yummy licious i love that to and from for you hello baby and this calls for confetti isn't that cute love that oh my gosh this one how beautiful and you know the garden shed can you imagine that outside the potting shed absolutely beautiful on a card let me just see if I can see that. Uh, there it is, garden shed, yeah. Oh, I know, all this little water mill, um, or this, any of those images, right next to the garden shed as well, as this country house. Absolutely fabulous. My head's ticking over, ding, ding, ding. Oh, love it, love it. Look at all the hedgerows, the ivy growing around the door frames. Oh, stunning. I like this one as well. Another move on from wonderful moments to beautiful moments. I think these characters are brilliant. I like them. Really nice. And, oh, yeah. A horizon there. Yes. I wondered what that line was for. <laughs> um... <coughs> I've got an itch, just sorry, it's 
driving me up the wall. Ow! Oh. Um, birthday Jubilee as well. I got that one. So sweet. Love this. Reminds me a little bit of that bloom and grow, is it? But I love the big happy birthday in this. It's a really good size. And you know me and big sentiments. I love them. So that's the reason I got that one. And the honeybee. I've got, I can't have the DSP without having the honeybee. So cute. I love the flowers, the way they curve both ways. I love it. Wishing you sunshine and happiness. Thinking of you, sweet friend. Celebrate every moment. Hello and thank you. I can see lots of lovely cards coming with these. So I'll put them to one side because I'm going to show you the cling ones now. So let me just move those out of the way. They're the photopolymer ones. Some of them I've just shown you a photopolymer as well, but they were the celebration ones. So you've just seen me with this one. I think this is great. You're invited. Save the date. Like I'm saying, little address books, invitations for parties even. You could just change the fonts because these this is open to any type of in, uh, invite then. You could do party, birthday, um, christenings. You know, if you've got the words, you can do those. So you saw the tulip punch. So obviously I've got to have the tulip. Uh, <laughs> May the memories of yesterday comfort you, you for today. That bit of a little sympathy thing going on, but you've also got hello, happy birthday, get well soon, happy Mother's Day. What a different, uh, what a beautiful difference one single life makes. And then happy Easter, happy spring, happy, happy everything. Okay. <laughs> so that's them. I've got the um, so many stars dies. I didn't buy it just for that. I bought it for these beautiful, beautiful flowers. Absolutely stunning. And I like the sentiment. So proud of you. You're a star. Each day is a new beginning. Thank you for being you. And you are the best. But look at these. I love it. It's going to make some beautiful floral cards. I like itchy nose today. And then obviously I had to have this one that and the, the one that was celebration the, the power of hope is it it's going to be amazing you've got uh, clusters of leaves grass you've got little tulips absolutely beautiful more grass dots like little rocks more birds then you can create a river under this beautiful bridge and a lake at the side this beautiful veranda. Oh, pergola, sorry. Pergola. And then obviously you saw the umbrella. I love this. Let's life's showers brings love's flowers. Shower with love no matter what no matter the weather, we're friends forever. Hello sunshine, it's your day. Rain or shine, you're always on my mind. I like that. But look at these cute little flowers. Again, wreath flowers. Make a little wreath. Keep building them up. And then you could um do little masks for them as well and just just build and build and build I love anything I love the welly gogs welly gogs that's what we used to call them when we were kids wellington boots you get the raindrops and it punch punches out the large one this one and this one so jam look to see if that's all in one stamp I know it's not they're all separate Oh, you'd have to work out how I'd have to cut a template out of a thick card and then you could place these in the right place and then put them on one big block. That way you could stamp them properly and cut them out all in one go instead of having to dodge around things and chop up paper you don't need to. So that's what I'll be doing with that one. So cute. Really cute. I love, whoops, I love my punches, you know that anyway. And then I've also got this one. I love it. This is the one I was on about. Look at these beautiful little flowers here to, to build a gorgeous little reef card. You've got the twigs, the branches as well. Little tiny ones there. 
Together we can get through anything. The world is yours. Uh, you make me happy. Send in hugs. Lots of love. You are wonderful. And then obviously to and from and for you. Love them. Look at, the, look at these little flowers. Can't wait to unflow these. So that's my order. I had... Did I have two punches? Yeah, two punches this time. 20 stamp sets. <laughs> oh yeah, isn't it? 20. Three embossing folders, two ribbons, two embellishments, doilies, five lots of DSP, and then there's a more pack. That's my first order. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. So I thought I'd come on and show you guys and uh, watch this space. So if you haven't already subscribed to my channel and you want to see what I make with these, please do. <laughs> Press the, uh, the little bell as well. That way you'll be notified of all the videos that I put up, which I tend to try my best to put one up every single day. I've been doing that now for the past... Oh, how long? 18 months or maybe even close to two years actually I posted every day so this night 1500 and let me just check two seconds 1657 videos for you to follow and plenty more to come <laughs> oh and I've got all my papers here as well so I've done all put all them stamp sets with their labels on I've just now got to make sure I've got a place to put all my DSP what I tend to do is say now because I've got all my cards that you'll see my shelves you can see them right there in the back now there so they all they hold 12 by 12 paper as well because I bought them off a shop the lady was selling about eight of them I wish I'd got an extra one now because of all the DSP so down the bottom i don't know if you can just me no you can't see the bottom but down the bottom there's one two three four five six seven eight there's nine spaces left for dsp so when what about extras like the new stuff it's gone on top of actual so i had the foiled pretty peacock foils and the the pattern DSP so I didn't have a space so that has gone on top of a blue car uh, paper uh, card stock these will go on top of red this will go on top of flirty flamingo because I know the colors underneath and I don't know where they are this will go under basic black or my whisper white this will go under pretty peacock and this will go under Bermuda Bay on top should I say because I know then if I keep my card stock and my DSP out on show then I tend to use it more so if I hide it away and put it in a drawer then I don't seem to use it that much so I used to when I first started crafting kept everything in a drawer because I was down there in the kitchen but now I'm up here it's uh I need to tidy this room I have got so much stuff it's unreal I think I might have to do a bit of downsizing and perhaps maybe box a few things up and do some giveaways or something but you know me most of my stamp sets and my retired ones I've probably only used once or twice but uh, now I'm no longer a demo I can keep them and just pull them out whenever I want and I had some lovely comments off ladies um, on a video the other day that I'd used older DSP than all the new stuff they said they like watching people demonstrate how much use they can get out of the DSP and stuff well I I was still doing videos using DSP that come out last June which is still current but they said that on the comments they said you tend to get ladies that will show the new stuff as it comes out but you don't get to see them play with it again because more new stuff's always coming out so the older stuff which is still current doesn't get used very often and they, they like the fact that i was fetching out the older stuff the, back from june 
rather than just playing my new stuff. So I'm good. I will be playing with this new stuff, but I'm also going to go back to everything that's still current and I'm still going to use my um, free as a bird papers um, my starts with art my garden lane I love that stuff um, and yeah I'm going to be pulling out because it's there to be used and until it retires well for me it's never going to retire so until I've run out and I can't buy it no more then I'm still going to use it so I'm still going to use them stamp sets as well so watch this space so come and see what I make lots of lots of options um we do a premiere in the night as well we have I set the videos to come out at a certain time so we can finish by 10 o'clock because I'm taking my meds at 10 um and I, it's time for me to wind down then before going to bed so yeah watch out for those come in and have a chat this roughly about 30 of us in there uh in watching the video but there's normally about a good 20 ladies and gentlemen that all come in just for the chat and then they what they re-watch the video afterwards because you can only um it airs all at the same time when it's a premiere and you we have time to chat then so but yeah come along and join in have some fun we made some amazing friends people have, have met via these premieres because they didn't know each other before and now they do they seem to like it's like a big family and uh, also there's the group but what in, in our group there's no chat it's just literally you can post a comment on somebody's beautiful pictures um, but it's not the same the chat is so personal it's everybody having a good old chinwag about their day the weather, the how many children they've had, we just get along so well, we seem to be able to talk about anything, so come and join the fam, love you guys see you soon God bless you all, bye